Hi, my name is Parlekar Tam Tam from a faculty in Wichita State University. Here is my first video. I'm making a video about how to convert a star connected element into a delta connected element. Um, here is a circuit diagram for a star. So I'm just taking a resistor. Um, I always follow positive phase sequence. We don't know about phase sequence at this point, but you will know in the future. So A, positive phase sequences go in clockwise direction. A, B, C. This is R A, R B, R C. So we have three elements, um, three resistors connected in star. I'm converting that into a delta connected circuit. Okay, why are we doing this? Because sometimes some elements are not connected in series, not in parallel. So it is kind of difficult to solve the circuit. Some uh, some circuits so we need to convert a star into delta or delta into star that way the elements will come back into series or parallel combination okay so here also I'm going to take this A B C I'm following the positive phase sequence so the resistance between A B terminals is called R A B resistance between B C is called R B C resistance between C A R C A Okay. Now, R A B equal to, uh, now I'm finding the R A B, remember when we are converting from star to delta, the delta values are bigger than star values. So what I'm saying, R A B is always larger than R A. Okay. Now, you're finding R A B, so let me use different color here. Okay. So this is my REB, right? So my REB equal to, REB is connected between A and B, right? So just add um, those two resistors, RA plus RB plus, and now multiply those two RA times RB over divided by the remaining resistor, RC, okay? So that's how we will find REB. Same thing, you can see RBC. So RBC is connected between, I mean, connected to B and C. So add those two, RB plus RC plus RB times RC over RA. And RCA equal to RC plus RA plus RC times RA over RB. Okay, this is simple way of converting star to delta. Thank you.